Welcome to Tabletop Gaming Guild. Tabletop Gaming Guild is all about the experiences and memories that playing tabletop games with friends and families can create. Today I'll be unboxing Papillion, published by Colossal Game and designed by J.B. Howell. Now I played this before at a convention and it was visually a very striking game. It was a pretty simple game though. It basically combines a Carcassonne style mechanic of laying tiles to try to match flowers if you get a set of flowers completed you can get onto one of the flowers and that's basically uh, area majority scoring so you're gonna get all these butterflies that you're gonna have to put attached to paper clips that are gonna clip onto the flowers uh, the paper clips from what I'm told do tend to break pretty easily they do give you a few extras for that and this punch board is pretty terrible to be very careful removing these components so I don't tear them that said these flowers do look really nice when they're fully built they end up being three-dimensional flowers with little extrusions that you can clip onto these are the bases for the different flowers and as you can see the scoring is different based on the different flowers get points for having the most second most or third most butterflies on the flower the main board is basically for drafting mechanics if I remember right you take all the tiles in a row but you know the first person is gonna get potentially more tiles to select from you know if it's three in a row you get all three but then the next person the highest number might actually be only two in a row and these are all your little paper clip butterflies, which, as I said, do look really nice, but, you know, they're a little bit hard to use. They're very tight and tiny and can potentially break. Next, we have the draw bag for the tiles. You know, it's a decent draw bag, but I know some people don't like this type of material. Extra bags and some meeples, it looks like. Uh... That's all the components for this game. As I said, it's got a great table presence. And it's a quick, simple game. But there are some issues with the production values. I already have a couple butterflies I'm going to have to glue back on. So this is more game for uh, a light gamer who is really into pretty things. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to check us out on other social media such as Instagram and Facebook. And don't forget to like and subscribe.